Hey guys, welcome back to Vitamin Y. So today is Sunday, and that means... No. Sunday? Sunday, right? Friday? Saturday? No. What is today? I don't know. Today is... Sunday. Sunday! Wait. Am I missing a day? No. Maybe? Friday. Saturday. Sun. Yeah. My bad. <laughs> I got caught up in my little world there. I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. What is today? Because I was like thinking. I was like, Friday is Yubel, Super Vice Yubel. Saturday is Yubel and Zector. Sunday is Yubel and Dark. I can't. I can't. Uh, you think, in over a hundred episodes, you think I'd be in, in my own damn routine by now, but nope. Nope. Still, just, uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, so yeah, we're using Yubel Dark Worlds. So, uh, last time we left off, I was, uh, did this nigga just, just hop on? <laughs> hi. Like, he wasn't on when I was about to start recording, and now he, he just popped in, and he's just like, hi. Like, Hi. <laughs> Uh, go ahead and activate this. Summon this. Effect. We'll go ahead use trans. Trans is pretty good. He's he's okay. He's like a one pitch, and he's a dark. You know, I like um Raven as well. But this guy, when he's you know when he's destroyed, you can go into your banished dark monsters, and you get to put that in your hand. So that's pretty good. The last time I left off, I was telling you guys a story about my Friday, so I'm gonna continue that. So last time we got up to the point where. Put this in the grave. Effect. Draw a card. Okay. Now I will go. Uh, gates effect. I will go ahead and banish. Discard. Draw. Effect. And go ahead and search for Dark World, which will be Grapha. There's no point in me even doing that right now. I was like, oh, I could go Dark World Dillions, that'd be dumb. So I'll set that, set that, and pass to him. I was at the survey thing, and we pretty much had to go to a computer where they asked you questions. The first one tripped me up. It was like, did you read the poster? What poster? And I was like, uh, yes. And they're like, you know, does anything on that poster affect you in particular? Uh Oh, this deck's dirty. This deck's dirty. He's pretty much trying to freaking burn me to death. Freaking not duel me, but kinda just kinda hit me directly and burn me to death. That's dirty. Yeah, it's just like really? Really? Wave motion cannon and watts? Like really? Really? Alright. All right, you fluck. I'm just gonna have to fluck you up, you mother flucker. See, see, it's, it's, see, it's getting, it's getting. Uh, uh. Oh, I guess. You know, so he's pretty much trying to burn me to death. So, yeah, that's okay. Gates effect. So, yeah, it was like, does anything on the poster affect you? I was like, uh, the, me being an idiot, the poster was actually right above the machine, but I didn't know. So I was just like, no, 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 because then most of the time when you're in like a blood donating place and it has anything to do with the poster, it generally has to tell you about that stuff. So I was like, no, and then, and then we moved on. I also had to ask you the classic question, have you had sex with another man since, you know, 1977? Uh, and once again, the answer was no. Fact. Pop that wave motion cannon. Like seriously? You're gonna try to sit there and burn me to death? Like no, fuck you. Grapha <laughs> It's just dirty, it's just dirty, you know. Watts already kinda dirty. But then he had to toss the wave motion cannon on top of that just to make sure that he's just gonna burn me to death? No. Uh-uh. Uh, then we'll go ahead and go activate Dark World Dealing. So, both of us draw. And both of us discard. Oh, another one. And I will discard 
no. Effect. Let me get it. Let me get. Actually, you know what? Let me go ahead and get another gate. Gate effect. I will go ahead and banish the snow. This like this. Bra. Draw. Effect. And draw. Pretty good. Alright. So now, what do I want to do? I can. I have plays. I still have plays. Well, I'll just do the classic play. Normal summon tour guide effect. I still got what? One more brow. One more brow, right? Yeah, I got one more brow. Yeah, two guys up to, goes up to three, and no one really gives a shit. <laughs> So, uh, they also asked me a question that was like, you have to have an examination, because it has to examine your body. And they're like, do you want to chaperone another doctor? And I'm like, no. Because the only doctor there was actually tour guide. Because the only person there to, you know, uh, pretty much chaperone, w well, the doctor would be a man. So I guess that was more for women. I mean, I don't really care. And I was like, really, what, what, what are you really going to examine? Graffa effect. Go ahead, put that back in my hand and summon. Then we'll go into battle phase. Oh, I didn't use trans effect. That's fine. I forgot about trans effect. I used everything but trans. That's actually technically too late, but I'm going to call that. That's fine. But it would technically be too late because I already declared the attack, so you would still get hit, but. You know, since there's no declaration of phases in this, I won't, you know, count them against them. Uh, I forgot that it's once per turn. Trans effect. So, I'll put this in the graveyard to draw a card. Effect. Draw a card. Why'd I do that? Oh, well. <laughs> Go ahead. So, after the questionnaire, we had to pretty much... We had to go through a lot. We had to go to like this examination lady who had this little mini lab. So she was, she was like, "Oh, uh, you know, what's your weight? You know, uh, let me check this. Let me check that. Let me check this. Let me check that. Check your blood. Check your blood pressure. For who and who? This deck is dirty. This deck is like the definition of dirty." He's slowly just trying to burn me to death. Which is dirty. Good thing though? He's running out of resources. It's one, two, three, four cards to my one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, I can count. No. Ah. If he wants to be a scrub and be running this dirty ass deck, then that's fine. I don't care. Yeah. I don't care. You know, should I really care? You know, he's just trying to use watch, he's just trying to poke me to death, so. What's he, level 8? Alright, he's level 8. He's level 8, and Graf is level 8, so I'll probably exceed with him and get level golem off my damn field. Oh, there's no point in me raging. This guy's unskilled. No, he's just trying to burn me to death, so... Obviously, I'm just going to kick him in the face, and he's going to end up regretting everything that he has to do with life. Who will be able to handle this situation best? Uh. Oh, that's pretty good. I'll probably make a... Oh, I can't. It has to be two level. Oh, now I can. Now I can, and I will. Uh, actually, no, I can't, because I am out of brows. Oh, to a guide, you kind of crappy. 
Actually, you know what? No, you're not, because I can go get and summon him and give me my Dark Lord card back. So, actually, time to actually have three tour guides on the field. So, effect. Actually, time to have three tour guides. Okay, that's pretty good. So, we'll go ahead and view the deck. Go ahead and summon the other tour guide. All three tour guides. What a world, what a world. Oh, really, these two? Into... You. Effect. And I will go ahead and get me my cards back, because I'm pretty much sick and tired of you doing shit to me. So I'm going to go preppy. I'm going to get this back. I'm going to turn it to the hand, summon Grapha. Then I'm going to pitch it out of the hand, search for Grapha. Then I'm going to pop, start popping his shit, because his shit's getting annoying. So, I figured out my weight. I, didn't, I wasn't really sure how hev heavy I was. Um, the scale in my house is broke. And it's been broke for a while. We just never fake replaced it. We're just like, eh, who cares? I don't care how much I weigh. So, told my weight. I don't want to tell you guys my weight. <laughs> so, I learned my weight. Pricked my finger. Checked my blood. Uh, you know, blood pressure was a little bit high. A little bit pretty high potential. A little bit above average. That's from playing Yu-Gi-Oh! Getting stressed out all the time. Um... Levy. Levy effect. Is there anybody else on the field who's getting an effect that you can see right now? You know, so I'm pretty much just going to try to kick this guy's ass right now. Like, kick him in the mouth. Detach. Swim back. So. And then she'll go to defense. Then we'll go. Uh, Grapha effect. What's up? We'll put this back in our hand. To summon Grapha. Might as well be in D because he's going to go into D anyway. Uh, Gates effect. I will go ahead and banish. Discard to the grave. Draw a card. Effect. Go ahead and search for Grapha. Uh, yep. I wouldn't be on if I wasn't in a duel. Activate Dark Lord Dealings. Either us draw a card, either us discard. Of course, I'm drawing you Bell. At this point, I should be drawing you Bell. Go ahead and discard. You gotta discard so I can say my effect. So I can go ahead and say Grapha effect. Grapha effect, pop that one. I don't care about this. I can play around that. You know, I can play around this. I'm not worried about that. Magical Cylinder. Okay. Um... Uh, I'm going to activate these two. One, two, three, four. Alright, I was hoping to get another, my third Grapha, but of course I don't. Uh, so I will go ahead and activate Call of the Haunted. Summon out her. She will go to defense mode. Uh, Grapha. Oh. Grapha effect. Go ahead, put her back in my hand to summon out this Grapha. Now I activate Dark World Dealings. Like, uh, do I want to do that? Hey, what is this? Oh, that's something reverse. Yeah, activate Dark World Dealings again. Draw. Nope, still not getting the Grapha. I'll go ahead and put this to the graveyard. Go ahead and put your card. No effect. Go ahead and give me my last Grapha. Uh, have I normal summoned this turn? I did. I normal summoned the tour guide, so I have normal summoned this turn. Uh, 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, I have eight cards in hand. Snow in the grave. All right, now I'm gonna figure out a way to get rid of this, but I'm probably just gonna overlay these two into um, into this guy. No, I can do this. I can do this. I'll overlay your lava golem and my grapha into Felgran. Felgran. Okay. That's working out fine. Everything is looking in check right now. Go down the checklist. Check, 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 check. So, uh, you get an additional 300, so tour guide is strong. So, tack. After that, we had, I had the doctor pretty much the pharmacist go check my well, my basic body parts, you know, eyes, nose, mouth, make sure everything is okay before I, you know, get blood. And this was like the most awkward shit ever. The guy says, open your mouth, flash the light in my mouth, and then he like looks and then just says, be right back, and then just runs out the room. Like, how do you think that would make me feel? Who? Tour guide is level three. Who is supposed to be in defense? He is a rank, not a level. <laughs> and life gives you lava gums, Melka Felgan. He's like, fuck! Like, mm -mm. He is a rank. Attack. Oh, are you running out of resources, sir? Are you running low on cards? You thought your little burn shit would be able to outbeat me? No, f you. <laughs> Getting not cheap with that shit. Now, you're the one that's fucked because aren't you like your cobas and your giraffes and shit? I attacked your monster with tour guide. I went tour guide attack, levier attack, Felgrin directly. I know what I'm doing. I want to get all that damage in. I need to beat you before you start getting too dirty with it. And knowing you, you'll probably just be like, um, Lava Golem? Again. Knowing you. So, you know what? That's fine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I have seven cards in hand. I will discard the U Bell. Why'd you gain life points? Main phase two. I actually done end phase. I had to discard a card. I have too many cards in my hand. I put the belt in the graveyard and go right ahead. So he'll probably top deck a lava golem. Go ahead. Go right ahead, sir. So you know, it's like how does it make me feel when the guy doctor just runs out of the room? I'm just like, oh god, what's wrong with me? What it, what could possibly be wrong with me? Draw. Hey, Ultimate Nightmare. What's up? One, welcome to the party. Welcome to the party. Uh, go Gates Effects. Gates Effect. We will go ahead and banish. See, aren't you guys glad that Return is still Return is still banned? Discard. Draw. Effect. Pop that. Uh, levy effect. I will detach. Summon a level. Th th actually, it doesn't matter. Summon. Uh, grapha effect. Put this back in my hand. And summon out grapha. Grapha to attack. <laughs> uh, I'm having way too much fun. I'm just going off. Like, look at this. Look at this, look at this. I got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. I couldn't draw this turn. My bad. So this would still be on top of the deck. I couldn't draw. For, uh, got about, uh, uh, Reckless. Totally forgot about Reckless. I accidentally drew. Not that I wanted to draw Ultimate Nightmare anyway, but still, I forgot about Reckless. 
Um, this should be game, you know. Unless this is something like something stupid like Morphine Jar number two, which I doubt. Doesn't he have that little guy that when this guy? No, it was the other one. Oh, he just quit. Oh. Too good, too good. See, this guy thought he could get me with being a little burn and cheap with that shit. And I'm like, no, 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 no. Look at this shit. Look at this shit right here. You see this shit right here? You see this shit right here? This shit was death. Anyway, let me finish with the story. Doctor comes back with another doctor, and he was like, oh, look at his, look at his throat, look at his throat. And he's like, and they shine a light in my throat. Apparently, I have this really, really rare syndrome where my epiglottis is higher up than usual, and it's basically called two-tongue syndrome. So I basically have two tongues. <laughs> Which is fine, you know? It's nothing dangerous. Like, when he looked at my throat, he thought I was choking on something, because when he was flashing the light, all he saw was just something in my throat. So he thought I was choking, but, you know, I'm breathing fine. So he was kind of freaking out. He was like, he's like, I've been a paramedic for five years. I've never seen this before. And the lady was like, I've been working here at the hospital checking people's bodies for seven years, and I've only seen this three times, you being the third case. So apparently I have something really rare. And, you know, it's not nothing life-threatening. Just I pretty much have two tongues. Which, if you guys see me in real life, uh, you know, hopefully you guys will. Like, if I ever get, like, a camera, I will show you guys my tongue. My tongue is really long. So that probably explains it, because, you know, my epiglottis is pushing my tongue up, and it's pretty much, you know, pushing my tongue out, which is, you know, fine. Fucked up my, my bottom row teeth, but, you know, it's fine. You know, I don't mind. Like, it's so bad that I gotta actually get my jaw cut and push back. I can't even get braces. But it's it's cool. It's cool. So, you know, after they were being amused by that, uh, my ear was actually kind of clogged. I was kind of worried that he was going to check my ear and be like, oh, it's clogged, you know, you can't do it. But he was so, you know, distracted that he really didn't check anything. He was supposed to, like, check my stomach area, check my ears, check, you know. He never got to it. He was just so uh, distracted by, you know, my epiglottis that he never got to just fully checking me. So he just said, I'm a fine. Uh, so I went to go give blood. Um, I sat down on the chair and um, I had a male a doctor. He was kind of just checking my, uh, you know, the pump, trying to pump and find my my veins, my arteries, and pretty much he couldn't find them at all. So he walked off, came back with like three more doctors. So it's him and three more doctors, so four doctors. I'm surrounded by four doctors. One girl, super cute. Like, oh my gosh, this girl was cute. Hella cute. <laughs> like, I'm like, this lady's so fine. <laughs> and she was just like, oh, we're going to tag team you now. So they pretty much are just checking my veins, trying to check my arms, and grabbing and latching on my arms, and just squeezing the shit out of my arms to try to find this vein. In the end, they could only find one that was decent enough. You know, the rest of them, they couldn't find any of my left arm, I only had one on my right arm. And they were pretty much like, we can only find one. If we take your blood and something mess up, we won't be able to give you back your blood. Also, you are actually really close to being dehydrated. Like, when they checked my blood for high, my hydration levels, I was supposed to be between 30 and 50, and then about that higher than that, I'm dehydrated. I was 48. I was, you know, I was kind of thirsty. Lips were kind of dry. I was thirsty. Um, so... Uh, we, I pretty much just couldn't go through with it, and it kind of sucks, you know. Uh, so I'm actually going to go back Monday, you know, get hydrated and stuff, and try again on Monday. But you know, it kind of sucks. I definitely wanted to get blood help people, but I just couldn't, you know. Like I said, they're like, we just don't want to risk it, because like I said, they, I only have, I only have one, you know. I, I have more. It's not like I only have one vein or artery, but I was dehydrated, so they were pretty much so thin and small that you, they couldn't detect them. So, yeah, that was my experience. Um, didn't, pretty much, I went there at 10. I didn't get out till like, 4. So, that was past my appointment that we set up for not only for Vitamin Y Episode 100 Live, but also, uh, I was supposed to be tagging with Bloody Hand, so I had to do that much later. I ended up uh, waking up really early Saturday morning, because, you know, he lives in France, so uh, I, woke up, I woke up early and then hit. In his time, it was, like, late in the afternoon, like, maybe 6, 7 o'clock in the afternoon. And then we did it then. So, you know, by the time you see this, you've probably seen that episode. And, uh, not only did I not get out four, I pretty much didn't go home. But then after that, I just went to my friend's house, and we chilled all the way till 10. Uh, my phone is ringing. Hold on. 
I'm finish I'm just like ending a video right now, so let me finish. Alright. So uh that's pretty much it. So I was pretty much gone the entire day of Friday, so I apologize. I definitely wanted to do uh the Vitamin Y episode one hundred live, so I definitely apologize on that. And I'm just getting a little bit busy, so uh don't worry about it guys. So Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for all the support. I hope you guys enjoyed this duel. I hope you guys enjoyed the story. And I will see you guys tomorrow with Ubo Beat.